Hello, my name is Lena Ruiz Gulko. This research shows results on the application of the 4 PADAFE methodology for design of a virtual classroom for the teachers to develop digital skills with the support of virtual platforms. Digital competence is necessary to do the current requirements of the information and knowledge society and to the need for educational institutions to respond to new ways of the learning and communication. A crucial point in this research is to establishing criteria regarding digital skills as the key competition of the 21st century requiring new skills. New scenarios and training environment digital competence include skill, knowledge and attitude support by ACT. The general objective of this research is to verify the implementation of the 4BADAFE methodology in the MOOC course, allow teachers teacher to develop digital skills and design massive virtual learning classroom. The 4BADAFE methodology is utilized to support teachers in development of a virtual learning classroom building the development and construction of a virtual course. The structure of the proposed methodology is made up of seven phases. Phase one constitutes the beginning to propose and design and the learning planning, the didactic methodology that characterizes the model and the technological framework that guaranteeing the learning process are defined. Phase two basis on the competence diagnosis, the didactic materials and instruments, the, stab the establishment of the technological and methodological environment or design. Phase 3 goes hand in hand with phase to use the interactive, synchronous and asynchronous activity. The other phase you can look in the article. At present, the advantage of technological tools, possibilities, influences the teaching learning process and the digital interactive content not only share information but motivates students as well. Teachers need to know and apply digital tools and resort for the creation of activities. Thanks, Lena. Hello, my name is Christian Castillo. Welcome for the quantitative investigation process. The 4P8D8FE methodology was applied in a virtual course called Digital Strategies to create a virtual learning environment with a population of the 118 teachers who participate. In the sample size wall calculates randomly based with 39 teachers. The applied survey was the applied survey was worked into four digital skills according to the phases of the 4PAD8FE methodologies distributed as follows. Competencies 1. Methodologies, strategies, instructional design, phases 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 7. Competence 2. Digital content design, phases 2, 3, 4, and 7. Competencies 3. Communication technologies record, phases 2 or phases 2. 2, 3, 5, and 7. Competencies 4. Online assessment extratense phases 2, 3, and 7. Result. The, com the competencies 1 have 19345 percent of the participants managed to develop digital skills during the course. In competencies 4 have 19345 percent chance the why or structured content converting their traditional materials into digital design, promoting dynamic and highly interactive content. I competency three have 19.4.90 percent of the participants indication that they expected their knowledge in the management of collaborative technology record. Finally, in competence four. Up 19.16% in process stage and applicability in the design of evaluation tools and evaluation rules. Conclu conclusion on the teaching digital skills virtual learning classroom with the 4 or PAD8FF methodology in in response on the hypothesis raised. The research determines the importance of the application of the comprehensive methodology where the process of designing a virtual classroom is explained step by step through each of the phases. Thank you.
Created using Powtoon.